being suspicious. Of course not, it's just you, babe. Listen, I love you. Of course it's just you. Oh, so I gotta go. I love you, bye. Hey, babe. Hi. Love you. I love you. Thanks for picking me up. Of course. Where's your car? Oh, we parked down here. Oh, okay. But I used your car. Okay. Well, I just wanted to save my gas. Okay. Why are you on your phone? I'm not on my phone. Who are you texting anyway? Listen, I what? If you could be any animal, which animal would you be? An elephant. You have to think about that, huh? No, nope. elephants are caring, compassionate creatures, and they don't forget anything. Elena the elephant. Oh. Listen, I gotta stop somewhere before we head out. Everyone is already there. We're supposed to be honoring Cooper's grandmother. I don't want to let them down. They'll be fine. I still can't believe that she's gone. Your grandmother was a really sweet woman. Listen to this. They wouldn't cremate her though. Well, she was a big woman. <laughs> ah, I mean, my condolences. You know, he's right though. That's terrible. Hey, shoot. If you guys couldn't lift her, you could have called me up. I'd get a couple buddies, we'd get her up there. I <laughs> married an idiot. A beautiful idiot. It turns out, like a few years back, seriously, this obese woman, they cremated her and the fat melted straight off her body and started a grease fire. That's not true. It's totally true. It turns out fat burns 20 times hotter than muscle. Oh, I always knew this would make me hotter. <laughs> the hottest. Break it up, I'm still in mourning over here. You didn't piss off my friend, did you? She's sensitive. She got mixed. I was listening to Garth Brooks. It's her car! That was driving! It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. None are such boys. Justin! Yes! <laughs> Justin! Shut up, Cooper. Come on, man. I'm just kidding, man. Dude, my condolences on your grandma, dude. She, she baked like the best cookies ever. Yeah, she did. Yeah. You know what? Let's propose a toast. Here's to Grandma's Cookies. To Grandma's Cookies! To Grandma's Cookies! To Grandma's Cookies. <coughs> Look, girl, a fortune teller. Oh my god. Oh, come on, it'll be fun, come on. Elena wants to go first. I do? You do. The first card will tell you where you are in relation to the questions that you seek. The three cards that follow will show you what you must overcome, what you must survive, or what will seal your fate. Ooh, this sounds so final. Oh, stop, chill. Three of Swords tells you of a heartache and emotional deception. Mm-hmm. There is someone in your life who fans the flames of insecurity and negativity. This person, you know who this person is. And through association with this person, you will always be at risk of becoming addicted to the very same venom that poisons you. The tower represents unexpected and extreme upheaval. My life could use some upheaval. Hey! You guys! Elena! <sighs> guys, I'm drunk. <laughs> yeah, you are, man. Hey, I'll go get him, alright? Hey, ladies, 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 ladies. <laughs> 
ma'am. <laughs> uh, hey, they're about to be closing this place up like any minute now. I was thinking we could get like maybe one or two more goes around in the haunted house, huh? Who's coming with me? Let's roll, Lena! Okay, okay. Why would you want to go to a haunted house when your grandma just died? <laughs> grandma was a wily lady. When we were kids, she would take out her false teeth and do jump scares on us. That's actually how I got into scares and horror. Well, she sounds like a fun lady. She was the best. Now, we all love a Hummer, but everyone remembers their first Gummer. <laughs> 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 Don't be an ass. Oh, I'm just kidding. Me and Nanny used to play flirt all the time. It's fine. He is an idiot. But he's not lying. Not I've lying. never lied. Okay. Huh? Enter! Oh man, good luck, buddy. Damn. Oh, well. Hey, uh, guys, uh, I gotta go help Sophie find her earring back here. She doesn't wear earrings. Ah. Uh, right, Cooper? They were pocket earrings. Well, do you like. Need my help? Or? No, no, Coop. I, we, we got this. Well, we're, we're next in line for the haunted house. We'll catch up. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I invite you to step right up. Open up your imagination to what awaits you behind this door. Born to the wrong family? Fell in love with the wrong woman? Witnessed the wrong atrocities? And though this man started as a pure soul, his story has turned him into a monster. Please, I would like to invite you inside to be our victims. What? You okay? All right. Uh oh. Oh, come on, dude. Oh, come on, man. No, I'm okay. You all right? Yeah, I'm good. Oh. I am so sorry, sir. We gotta get out of here. What? She's fine. He Look at him. Oh. He is not fine. And he's your friend. We gotta get out of here. Ross brought him. He can take him. Who knows what they're doing? I'm okay. I'm good. No, you're not. Shut up, Cooper. Let's go. Come on, man. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Man, I love you, baby. What you love about me, babe? Oh, I love how cute you are. I love how funny you are. I love how cute and funny you are when you're grumpy. <laughs> Sophie? Sophie? Sophie! Sophie! Sophie? Sophie? Ah! Oh. I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha
Oh, oh shit! God. What was that? What's that? Didn't sound good. Shut up, Cooper. How are you feeling back there? Better, actually. Yeah, well, you smell worse. What the? Well, holy shit! How does this even happen? I don't know, man. It doesn't look like we rode over anything. I don't have any service. Does anybody else? Zero bars. Nothing. We might have to walk back to the haunted house. What? This is like two miles. Did you have a better idea? Smoke signals, carrier pigeon, two tin cans like a really long string. It's beautiful, man. Let's roll. Hello? What up, what up? Sorry, I know you're closed. Sorry, I puked earlier. Hey, look, Russ's car is still here. Oh, sweet, that means he's still here. Let's, let's bum a ride. Yeah, let's go. Hello? Hello? Who the hoo? <sighs> what the fuck, Justin? Who is June? Oh, gotta pee. talking about? What do you mean? I just saw the messages. Don't play dumb. I don't even have service right now, okay? Just because you don't have service doesn't mean you can't check your messages. Oh, are well, you just looking over my shoulder now, creeping on me? What? You want to talk about trust issues? Wow, screw this. I am done. I, I can be kind of an idiot, right? Yeah, you can. It's just that I hate fighting with you. Do you? Look, listen, I'm, I'm sorry whatever I did made you mad. You can't not be a dick, can you? What are you talking about? <sighs> Nothing. I'm gonna go look for Sophie. Whoa. What was that? What was that? Somebody just went in there. Uh, maybe it was Russ and Sophie? Maybe. Let's go check it out. Hey, Russ! Sophie! Hey, we got a flat tire, guys. Was that you guys? Are you right. Hey guys. Hey, is somebody there? Hello? Our car broke down a few miles back and we could, we could use some help. Hey, I, I know you're out here. This isn't funny. Okay? Jeez. No, no, come back. Where are you going? Hey. Over you, darling. You come to me. This place looks cool. Is so realistic.
You're pretty. <sighs> Step right up. Oh my God! Run! Run. Hello, I'm Liliana Simons with WHOZ News Team, and I'm standing in front of Bradley Farms, the once family-friendly haunted attraction turned slaughterhouse. With the deaths of almost a dozen people, it is believed that four nights ago the Bradley family was brutally murdered. The culprits then utilized their haunted house business as a killing field to massacre more local residents. The murders are believed to have been committed by these people. Sylvia and Nathaniel Crawford, adopted brother and sister and leaders of the Crawford Gang, also known as the Crawford Carnival Cult. Authorities say if you see either of these two individuals...